what's up y'all welcome back to my channel on behalf of brit if you're new here welcome i'm Brittany, and today we are doing a day in the life video it should be like a day in the life of a braider but i might mix in a couple other things because i only really have one braid appointment so i don't really know if it's going to be much of me working i know my two things on my agenda today i just wrote it down i'm still using my notepad y'all and the two things that i absolutely have to accomplish today is one a hair appointment my client miss rashida it's a house call so i'll be going to her house and i'm taking y'all with me and then i really need to disinfect some of my tools i have a bunch of them that i cleaned over the weekend it was then it was a group of them that i did not clean because i ran out of baking soda i've been trying this new hack i found on tiktok where some braiders use baking soda to clean their tools versus running through all of their um barbicide and using a bunch of different different chemicals the baking soda gets down into those little crevices in between the combs and in the bristles of the brush and it kind of breaks up that stuff um that we don't see um the liquid barbicide apple cider vinegar um dish detergent all of those things are still good but y'all know baking soda is really essential when it comes to cleaning so i've tried it recently it works but i use like the last corner that i had to get a bunch of them done over the weekend and i'm like nah I want to get a fresh box so we're going to run out to the store to get baking soda we're going to go to miss rashida's house miss rashida is one of my newest um most favorite clients like i don't really favor a client that fast but she's really really cool she is a mother of three daughters and i do her and her kids here different personalities her youngest is five um, her middle child is 12 and then her oldest is actually my age of course the youngest one gets her braids and beads the 12 year old just got purple box braids the other day miss rashida is getting blue um butterfly locks today and i need to go pick those up because she knew she wanted blue locks but i guess she thought it would be easier to find than what it has been for her but i know where to find them so we'll be going to beauty max to get miss rashida's locks Hopefully I can find what she need because I talk big talk like, yeah, I can find that. My store has it. So we're going to go do that, come back um, with the baking soda, clean those tools, and then I'll just let y'all spend the day with me. I just got up today. I'm in a good mood. It's my sister's 30th birthday. Happy birthday, Tan, if you're watching this. And yeah, I'm just feeling good. I said, you know what? I have a very easy day. It's not one of those days where I have appointments back to back where I'm kind of just like, uh, I don't need to vlog today because my day is loaded and I don't want to slow the day down. I got one person and one person only. So I'm going to take y'all with me to her house. I need to open this package. My mom will be here later this week and I I came in from my car earlier and her hair was here i'm doing her hair while she's in town one of my aunts is having surgery so my mom and um a couple of my aunties my aunt deborah and my aunt mildred will be here this weekend and my mom is going to get her hair done for thanksgiving that way when i go home next week um her hair will already be done i don't have to worry about getting off the road and doing any hair so she ordered the hair and had it sent here and i'm about to open that up just to make sure that it's enough hair because she was kind of skeptical like is that gonna be enough hair i use the hair all the time y'all jamaican bounce my mom wants to try it out she's seen it in several videos she likes the way it looks she's going back red right now she's blonde but for the holidays she wanted to go back to her 99j child so i'm gonna open up this hair just to make sure because she kind of got me like uh is it enough so i'm gonna open that up i'm gonna throw on a little jacket y'all kind of bundle up it's cold outside today and then we need to head out of the house miss rashida's appointment is in an hour and i still have to stop and get her here before heading out to her house so that's what's going on y'all it's this little piece that is sending me i'm trying to let my hair breathe i'm definitely going to do something with it this weekend and then probably do it again for thanksgiving next week but um i just threw a quick little messy bun in it and baby i got my sides out and this curl is hanging and then this side is a little broke off it's <laughs> poor thing <laughs> i just look crazy so excuse me listen we all have our days where we step and then some days we just be looking homeless and that's what's going on right now y'all i'm working do not judge me let me go get some scissors and then we'll open up this package 
just needed to grab my scissors, which was hiding, so I can open this up. Excuse the chaos on my desk. It's a lot of packages, a whole lot of on this desk. I opened this package before I started the vlog for today. This is for my client, Soraya. She's um, going on a cruise for Thanksgiving. My girl is cruising for the holiday. And instead of her ordering the hair and bringing it to me, she just went ahead and had the hair shipped to my house. So it's already here. And I just wanted to open it and make sure everything was in there. She told me to make sure both colors were in there because she's doing um, like a dark brown with blonde highlights. She wanted to just make sure she had what she needed. So I opened that. Okay, let's see what this hair is looking like for Mama Charlie. And I'm just gonna crochet this in, y'all, in case you're wondering. Um, y'all know the Jamaican bounce can be crocheted in, it can be braided in for like single box braids. Yeah, my, this is more than enough hair. I know you're gonna see this. I'm gonna open one so y'all can see it. And um, the gift, it always comes with a crochet hook, y'all. <laughs> the hair I showed y'all on the desk, each of those brands, um, the dark brown hair and the blonde hair both came with latch hooks i opened here yesterday and the day before that all came with latch hooks but this is the jamaican bounce y'all know the hair it's really cute so i'm gonna probably take it all out of the ziploc bags and kind of let it you know it's all super compressed in this um you know package so i'm gonna let it drop and just sit on my desk with the other hair and when my mama get here in a couple of days her hair will be ready to go i'm excited i know this is gonna look really cute on her because big hair on her round face really cute but that burgundy is tea perfect for the holidays so we'll probably do this for thanksgiving and probably run it back they had a, like a brighter version i'm gonna try to talk her into that like the cherry burgundy talk her into that for Christmas but if she likes the Jamaican bounce on her so the way she has been loving it on my other clients so yeah I just wanted to open that and I need to run out of the house y'all because what if Beauty Master don't have the blue box and then I gotta go on a wild goose chase to other hair stores trying to find it I'm sitting here really so yeah let's run to Beauty Master and then I will catch up with y'all at Mr. Sheeta's house so many aisles full of locks and I'm just trying to see where mm, these are cute but they're 10 inches and I don't know if she's gonna be wanting to pull them up in different styles and stuff I want like a 14 inch okay here we go right here the same ones in a 14 inch okay so i just called her and she said she actually prefers the 10 inch so i just put the 14 back and i'm gonna grab three tens beauty master finally has the mango and lime for braiders and this is the cheapest i've seen the gel 7.99 so you know i'm grabbing that now let's head to our clients gave you a heads up or something Communication. So you in shambles. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Can you tell her favorite color is blue? Look at the couch. This hair is so pretty out of the packaging. Sorry, y'all, it's a lot going on in the background. The house cleaners are here. But yeah. scary. Yeah. So the therapist was telling us last week, she was supposed to stay after yesterday. And we were going to pick her up. And she oh, the teacher told me I couldn't stay after school. I said, the hell? <laughs> you were supposed to. We were right. going to pick you up. And then, so she didn't to know. To rehearse and stuff? Yeah. So, but today's the play. So I'm going to call them late, by the way. You in kindergarten, little girl. <laughs> Damn, teacher calling me, talking about who's in this Brittany because she said that she can braid every pair. In class, giving out the braider information. Yeah. <laughs> this is what she's going to do. <laughs> I don't mind. But it's just so, I was just like, what? Yeah. She comes out and like, what are you talking about? <laughs> yeah, so Mary said that Miss Brittany is going to braid every pair. And she comes home and says, okay, thank you. You know, that's great, but come on. Right. <laughs> you can't go to school. You're supposed to be in there learning. Mm-hmm. 
Nah, I mean, unless they were Asian ones, please. I'm gonna get us some. Yep. I said, Again, like, explore the area, try different restaurants. Yep, yep. we need date nights. Mm -hmm. So you can drop me and Mary and Elena right off real quick. Yeah. You live right around the corner. And you got them all so damn fast, your head will spin. Right. <laughs> mean what you say when you yep. say it. Yep, because I said we would drop you off. <laughs> and here comes me and Mary. Why would we want to taste off? That's what they call her. So, me being a mom in, 20, um, in um, 2020, um, can't deal with your mouth. <laughs> They can't deal with it. Yeah. Yeah. They be thinking my girls are nice and sweet. I'm <laughs> like, you around. Mm -hmm. Y'all should know Ashley. <laughs> you know her damn mama, y'all know Ashley and sweet. <laughs> and Ashley's a teacher. And she's like, hey, you know, go on. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Y'all fool, but that shit, I ain't. <laughs> <sighs> I know better. Good time, you had a good time. Uh, Vegas is... I wanna go. You never been here? No, I'm trying to go in April for my mom's 55th. She uh, wants to go. She's never been to Vegas, so we're trying to go for her 55th. Um, that is a nice... where'd you stay? Which hotel? We stay, um, uh... I was gonna say, you know, I have an adult daughter and I have two young kids. She grown, but other two, mm -mm, can't date me and, and not like kids, don't want to be around. Oh, she got children. Yeah, hi. R-E-N. And hit them, yeah, the multiple. R-E-N, not child, but children. Yes. Come in Kroger for this today. I come in here minding my business and the florist is putting together fresh arrangements. This is not what I'm supposed to be doing right now. We had so many good ones out today. So many fall combos. The orange roses are catching my attention. It's holiday Starbucks cups. Y'all, I'm not even a big Starbucks fan, but the cups are pretty cute. The sushi chef. I'm gonna grab some sushi for lunch. I'm gonna get this spicy shrimp roll. Wait, no, the grilled salmon is looking a little better. Yeah, we're gonna take this. This is why I'm here. I'm gonna get a big box so it'll last me longer. This Kroger has a weekly special section, so I'm about to check this out. Wine that's marked down, food, everything. They have these holiday sprinkles on sale that'd be cute for like some Thanksgiving treats. I'm not sure what I'm baking yet for Thanksgiving, but I know I'm baking. They have these fall farmhouse themed sprinkles. That'd be cute on some cupcakes, bonfire. I don't know, I might snatch one of these up for some treats. These are all the Halloween ones. Blood and Bones, Fabulous, Fabul oh, Fabulous can't read and it says harvest those are actually cute i'm gonna get the harvest ones yeah i like these with the fall leaves in them they also have these like cocktail popsicles in their last chance section they said the price is reduced to 14.25 this is 1801 i'm trying to figure out if these are actually a deal they have these um pomegranate wine cocktail popsicles you put them in the freezer Y'all know I used to make the little adult popsicles. This is 18% alcohol, but this will save me some work. It's cute and creative. These are skinny tropical. Hmm. Y'all, Kroger doing a big one. They already have their collection of the Wakanda Forever dolls. They don't have Black Panther himself, so I wouldn't get nothing for my nephews out of here. They just have Shuri, which I'm not against her, but my god baby seeing she's too small for her. A doll like this right now she would probably be more into this little one but look at her it says four plus and my god baby is two i don't even think she'll play with this but y'all come to kroger with your kroger card the 12 inch figurine this big one right here it's only 11.89 and then the small figurine they don't have the price next to it, but you can get the big old dog for only $12. And that's a cute Christmas gift. These 
these are all of the materials that need to be cleaned this week. This brush is really gross. A lot of the brushes get really bad and the baking soda, it sits in them and kind of breaks up some of that stuff. So I'm gonna do that. But right now I'm waiting for the water to boil. I still use my hot water and then I put a little bit of barbicide in there. So the ingredients for my new routine is hot water, barbicide, and baking soda. I used to do vinegar, a little bit of detergent, like it used to be a lot. So now I just have three ingredients and this normally gets the job done. I have my towel waiting over here on this shelf for the combs and brushes to lay down and dry. Um, and then I'll take a rag and kind of get in there and clean anything I still see. Excuse the background noise. Fenty had to come over here. It's just way too cold for her to be in her usual corner. Her cage is normally by the um, slide and glass door over here, but it's super cold today. So I moved her away from the window and this is where she is. And she kind of freaked out because she don't like being over here for some reason. I put on this hair on a movie for her to kind of distract her from what's going on. So we're gonna clean these tools up. This water be ready to boil everywhere. It don't take long at all. God damn. Ooh, we that's hot. Okay, 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 okay. Ooh. All right, so the water goes in first. Let's set that over there. Gonna sprinkle in our baking soda. A little bit of the cardboard got in the water, but that's okay. And y'all see that? This stuff right here is the truth. I don't know why I didn't start using this sooner, but thank God for TikTok, right? That's how you know it's working. Oh, these combs tangled up. Y'all see how bad? I thought I had taken all of the hair out of the combs, but I guess not. Let me get that piece of cardboard if it's not too hot. Oh, shoot, that's hot. Never mind. That's going to sit in there. And the stuff is already like detaching from the combs. Like, look, we already got stuff floating in the water, which is good. Oh, I want to get that cardboard that is bothering me, <laughs> but it's too hot in there right now. Okay, let me pour in the barbicide so this can start soaking. Pour in just a little bit of this, and there's our concoction. I'm gonna try to take this comb and kind of move it around in there. What is in this water? What is that? I thought I seen some paper. And this is the remedy, y'all. Baking soda, barbicide, and boiling hot water. And we're gonna have sparkling clean utensils in minutes. Put everything back where it belongs. Y'all, I got other stuff I could be doing, so I'm gonna walk away and let it do its thing. While the combs and brushes are soaking, I'm gonna open up my new napkins and put them in my bathroom. I really like these. I don't think I showed these to y'all because I think I discovered them after I showed y'all the discounted area in Kroger. But these were in Kroger for, I wanna say 30 cents a pack and I got three packs. That was all that was left of them. So I'm gonna put these out. I've told y'all before how I like to have cute little napkins in my bathroom with cute little sands for my clients. So. I'm gonna open these new ones and then I'm gonna burn my beignet candle for the first time. I got this candle from a candle shop in New Orleans called OMG when I was there um, last month. So I'm gonna burn that for the first time and put out my new napkins. I need a napkin holder so bad, you guys. I might go on Amazon tonight and look for one that might match my little black girl magic theme in my bathroom because this is ridiculous. I sat them straight down, didn't like the way that looked, and now I kind of spread them out like a deck of cards, but we are gonna burn this for a little while and come back and see if it actually smells like a beignet.
so we got our tools all cleaned up. It worked again this time. So I think that is gonna be the routine that I stick to. My baking soda. I hear somebody at the door and I'm trying to figure out who it is because I'm not expecting anyone. Hold on. I don't know who this is. Hello? Hey. Hey. I'm fine. So much. Right. <laughs> and another package. I was about to say, I thought Mr. Sushita was the only one I booked today. I was like, just when I thought I was gonna relax and eat my sushi, I might have another client that I forgot about, but it was not that. I have a package, y'all will see it in my weekend vlog. It's a weekend vlog coming up, so y'all will see that, but I'm basically making some treats and I'm infusing them with alcohol and those are the infusers. But yeah, I just wanted y'all to spend the day with me. It was a really short and sweet day, just that one appointment. I hope y'all enjoyed it, even though it was kind of short. Just a little eight hour day. I think y'all probably spent with me a full eight hours. Um, Mr. Sheeta's appointment was, appointment was probably maybe like 15 20 minutes shot of three hours but we also went to the hair store we went to kroger we got a few things so we did a little shopping um i think i opened that hair with y'all earlier I disinfected my tools showed y'all that new routine so that was pretty much my day i think y'all seen in kroger earlier that i brought some sushi and i've been dying to eat it i just wanted to get that um get those tools cleaned up and get that done so now i'm gonna pour me some wine eat some sushi and watch love is blind season three and yeah, that's my day, y'all. I will see y'all in the next video. Yeah, whatever the next video will be, uh, y'all will see me soon in the next couple of days because I'm back trying to be consistent. So yeah, y'all, I love you all. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, y'all should be seeing this around Thursday, Friday-ish. So I hope you guys enjoy your weekend. Have a very fun and safe weekend. I will see you guys either late Sunday or early Monday. <laughs> love you all.